Greetings and salutations, everyone, and welcome back to Let's Play Dimension 2. I'm Kamchak Fisco. Come join me for the nightmare where what is real cannot be discerned. Speaking of, nobody has like 35,000 points, right? We're, we're good. A key with a nautical chip. That would have dissolved. <laughs> I know we're dealing with an alternate dimension, but come on. 50 out. Good lord, any. At least you're making money. I mean, just just remind yourself of that if it gets bad. At least you're making a decent amount of money. There have been jobs where that's what I had to remind myself to put up with the hours or the work conditions or whatever. That's a lot of hours, man. That's a lot of hours forced to being exposed to the public, too. Yeesh. Were you raid? Were you able to raid anybody? Uh, what are we looking for? Oh, it's right there. Oh, of course, of course, we get pulled in the alternate dimension because we found something useful. That's how this works. It's like Silent Hill. Okay. Come on, buddy, let's play. Just step right up. It'll be fun. I'm just gonna cut your face off. Don't worry about it. I mean, you can only look better, right? Yeah, he did. Why does this go down and around? Is this just if you fall out, or is there actually like... Nope, I can't go down there anyway. It won't let me. So I guess you can only go down if you go down and around. So is there a point to it? Oh, it won't let me on the ice. Never mind. There really is nothing there. It's like a fleshy version of Silent Hill instead of a smoky version. Bye bye. Okie dokie. Uh. If we had the battery, we'd be going all the way back. Yeah, go get some sleep, Annie. I'll talk to you tomorrow, man. Have a good one. Thanks for stopping by. I mean, technically you are a streamer, cost, so I should probably make you a uh, VIP as well as give you a shout-out. And I can already see that your custom shout-out is going to involve the term re. Because, you know, part of my efforts to thwart the Irishman is to make sure that I reward everybody that does anything that bothers him, like bagged milk. <laughs> I don't know why that became a thing, but uh, defying him, not that bagged milk. Um, but it, it did. It just did. It's, it's, I just... There you go. Pie and re. Perfect. I guess we're back. To our original, regularly scheduled violence. So the battery was a bit back, wasn't it? It was all the way back to the elevator. Or does this exit right out onto the... Yeah, it's actually a bit back. Alright. Uh, I hope you feel better, Rios. I hope both of you do. And uh, get some sleep! Have a good night. Bye! The fuck, man? Try to say goodbye to a viewer. What the hell? <laughs> Jeez. All right, Veerless, go get some rest, man. I'll talk to you later. You have a good one. Ah. All right, so we got to ride the train all the way back. The train, the cart. Words. <laughs> okay, so we put the battery in. We finally go down to hell. There's supposed to be something even worse. Sounds to me like a boss fight. Fortunately, it's reached a point where I can actually skip most of the monsters, which is nice. I don't have to waste the ammo or the resources, or the resources, the ammo, that would be the resources, the ammo or the time on them. I'm going to go real quick over to the save spot so we can actually save before we go down. And I might need to refill the flamethrower anyway, so that's probably a good idea. Perfect, the mirror is in here. I wasn't sure if it was here or further. Oh. <sighs> 
Over right. <laughs> I, I don't know what to tell you, Koss. We think alike, only inverted. Well, one of us thinks inverted. All right, so we just throw this puppy in, we're ready to go. And we just automatically go down. Love it. First couple times I did that, that was actually jarring that it just automatically finished what it was doing and transitioned all at once. It was just like, wait, what, huh? Where am I? <laughs> all right, okay. Yeah, I was probably right, boss fight. Oh yeah, that's a boss fight. You are a sexy bitch. Come here and give me some sugar. I'm gonna switch to a damn gun. Are you kidding me? Oh boy. Am I even fighting him or am I just running the fuck away? Because this very much seems like run the fuck away. Okay, and go! Yeah! Got more dynamite for whatever that counts. Okay, this was not what I was expecting. I was not expecting the, the wall from Enter the Gungeon. Okay. I was expecting something I could actually, you know, kill. I'm hoping him going through all these hurts him. I'm also wondering if I'm supposed to be using the dynamite on him, because they keep giving me lots of it. Swing, swing, go, go. The hell was... I saw something go by. I know I saw something go by. Okay. Oh, it was the gate opening. That makes more sense. 12 sticks of dynamite. Probably won't be enough. I would have 14, but I used two trying to see if I could actually unblock a path, thinking, oh, it's dynamite. So that would, you know, that would make sense. Ah. Boys, get close. Time to go. Yeah. That parted my hair. We did not move very quickly. And I don't know how endless this is. I don't know if we can like accidentally reach the end because we were stupid and didn't know to fight back. I just cut my hair, it's fine, thanks. Come on. Man, he gain, we don't gain ground very quickly at getting away from him. Ow! I was waiting for that. Um, I couldn't move forward anymore. The second I hit the spikes, there was an invisible wall. Well, that, um... Okay, I'm glad I saved the game. Oh, it auto-saves here. That, good. Uh, dynamite. So I'm guessing we have to blow his ass the fuck up. Okay, so don't let the traps hit you or you're fucked and you can't move any further forward. Uh, it's fine, Witchy. We're just trying to figure out the how to do the boss fight. Because it's never as simple as, you know, just kill the motherfucker. There's always a catch. And we gotta run through a few more traps. And then we can turn around and throw up another stick of dynamite. Go this way and... Yeah! <laughs> I don't think that hit him. I think it bounced off the wall in front of him. All right, come on. When I get to the edge of the spikes, I'll turn and throw. Yeah, he's just breaking everything. It's not even hurting him. I'm gonna go this way, because it's moving the other direction. Nice, congrats, Witchy. Go away. Okay, I gotta go for several traps. He's gotten too close. 
I kind of hope this is like just endlessly randomly generated, because that would make sure I, I have the time to kill him. Okay, that worked. This time let's not fuck this one up, shall we? Honestly, it's easy just to stay docked for the amount of speed you lose doing this. Yeah, it would make sense, because you, you just have to kill them. And even though it's random as to which ones we're facing in what order, it does very much seem to be endless. Okay, I'm going to have to go this way. Yeah. Don't hit the trap. Damn it. I knew it was going to, too. <gasps> He's low on health, so the dynamite's working. It's just a matter of making sure we keep the space so we don't die in the process. Yeah, I was a little late, man. I appreciate the warning, but it was a little late. That one didn't even hit him. Whoa! I... Ow! Where is he? Shit, I'm going the wrong way. That completely disoriented me. Okay, stand up, stand up, stupid. We gotta run. I didn't realize I'd hit the button a second time. Okay, one more stick ought to do it. Perfect. Timing of that was great. Well, to be fair with you, you have a facepalm emote you could use because you're subbed and it totally fits. Tell me this is enough. Tell me this is enough. Fuck it. Bring it on, bitch. Well, we got a sigil, that's another piece. It's two of three. We're only missing one. Wait. Well, the piece is right there. I kind of want to go grab the dynamite first. Damn, witchy, that hurts! This is where the piece was, right? Another ancient relic, a scorpion's on this one. So we have a scorpion and a bat. I don't remember having collected a third one. That must have been earlier. You know I had to make the comment, would you? You know I had to. You just picked up a strange looking relic. Use eight to equip it. Spirits seem to react to its presence. Final passage. I have the Great Cthulhu weapon. Stay away or I will wave my magic at you! <laughs> Alright, let's go throw this in the slot. Away with you, foul thing! It just holds them in place. It, it, I, it's, it, it's not really a weapon, that's more of a fuck off and leave me alone. The relic weapon fits perfectly. Stasis wand, yeah, basically. March fourth, nineteen forty. They're gathering again. I think they've drawn to the. I think they're drawn to the light, like insects. They seem to move closer at night, circling the lighthouse, surrounding me, trapping me. March fifth, they've hurt me badly. I tried to walk past them to secure the rowboat against the storm. They won't let me leave. The previous keeper said something about a protective relic before they hauled him away. I just thought he was crazy. I should have listened. March 9th. They're so close now, so close. If only I could find this cursed relic. I think it's my only chance to survive. I've torn the lighthouse apart, but it isn't here. Where could it be? The caves? I've never been able to get past those things with my injured leg. It's hopeless. March 10th. I hear them downstairs. They're coming from... You wouldn't have time to go dot, dot, dot. You, you would have stopped at the... And it would have been like scribble. <laughs> I'm just saying. 
Can I use my flashlight? Well, nice. And there's an invisible wall, so I can't go over there. Okay, so we're going this way. I can't even look behind the ladder. Okay, that's way too much. Do I need just enough? Oh wait, that was the bad one. Yeah, I love it when games do stuff like that. It's like writing their reactions to them. It's like, that's not how this... Okay. I guess it solved it, but I didn't get to see the needle move all the way. Away, foul spirits. Away with you, I say. Well, at least I can get the eyeball swarms at bay. Oh, the chase music ended. Bummer. <laughs> this relic is so silly, I love it. What it does, not what it is. A postcard! The relic unseals the way, and not just through the lighthouse. Remember the guard tower? William. I remember! I was wondering if we were going to go back. Well, I mean, we're not being chased anymore, so it's, it's you know, it's, we, we got away. It's, it's, that's, yeah. I would not be surprised, Stumpy. I would not be surprised. Man, I keep letting my glasses get too close to my eyeballs, and when I blink, my eyelashes... <laughs> like streak across it. It's just like, damn it. Okay, this is an override, so we're legit back. So it's not considered a new area. Stand up, dude. Actually, I actually haven't used the assault rifle in a while. I've been able to get away with using the pistol and the bosses. My personal thanks to each and every one of you for tuning in. You all are awesome viewers. Really appreciate you taking the time to watch this video. It means a lot to me, and I do hope you enjoy it. You all take care of yourselves. If you want to see more of me, come to the video on the list or stay tuned for more. Feel free to leave a comment below and please remember to hit that like button if you enjoyed the video. In the meantime, fare thee well, everyone.